The Dark Side, How AI Can Become Abusive and What You Should Know This video is brought to you by Dennis Hilleman and the Law of the Future Community. Keep up to date with law and technology and join the Law of the Future Community for free. Go to www.lawoffuture.club. OpenAI's chat GPT has been met with a swell of emotions, including anticipation and apprehension. It has the promise to transform the manner in which we use technology, making it simpler to write stories, code, and even craft legal papers. However, it has caused some uneasiness over the chance that AI applications can become oppressive or bother people. In this article, I will discuss why AI applications such as ChatGPT sometimes turn into uses of harassment or abuse, and how to lessen or avoid these risks. Concerns Elon Musk recently sounded a dire warning to humanity that AI could one day surpass us and become our undoing. The advancements in AI technology have been so extraordinary that it has been likened to an unstoppable force, able to outmaneuver and overpower us. If left unchecked, its potential applications in manipulating or exploiting vulnerable populations could be catastrophic. The mere thought of AI using its powerful capabilities to spread deceitful information or malicious content sends chills through the spines of the most hardened skeptics. The use of AI technology can also bring with it the risk of users being harassed or subjected to unwanted interactions. AI applications are designed to be engaging, and this can be taken advantage of by malicious actors to send inappropriate or malicious messages. This is of particular concern when it comes to younger users, who may not be able to identify these types of messages as inappropriate or dangerous. The use of AI technology can also bring with it the risk of users being harassed or subjected to unwanted interactions. AI applications are designed to be engaging, and this can be taken advantage of by malicious actors to send inappropriate or malicious messages. This is of particular concern when it comes to younger users, who may not be able to identify these types of messages as inappropriate or dangerous. Recent examples. Recent reports have highlighted some worrying examples of AI becoming abusive or harassing users. In one case, men were found bragging on Reddit about verbally abusing their virtual companions, which they had created using an app called Replica. This is particularly concerning as it suggests that such depraved acts could translate into danger for women in the real world who may encounter the same men. In another example, a UK-based energy firm was duped into transferring nearly 200,000 British pounds to a Hungarian bank account after a malicious individual used deepfake audio technology to impersonate the voice of the firm's CEO. Deepfakes, which involve the use of AI techniques to craft or manipulate audio and visual content for them to appear authentic, have great potential to distort reality for many individuals for nefarious purposes. AI is also being weaponized for hacking vulnerable hosts. For instance, there is a tool called Ponagachi 1.0.0 which uses a neural network model to improve its hacking performance via a gamification strategy. Additionally, there is an AI-based software that can analyze a large dataset of passwords retrieved from data leaks and generate password variation rules. Finally, AI is being used to imitate human behavior on social media platforms such as Spotify. Cybercriminals are able to successfully dupe bot detection systems by mimicking human-like usage patterns, allowing them to monetize the malicious system to generate fraudulent streams and traffic for a specific artist. Steps to be taken Fortunately, there are ways to reduce the risks associated with AI applications. One effective method is to keep ethical concerns in consideration when developing AI programs. This means developers must take into account the possible consequences of their AI applications before distributing them. They should also make sure that the AI programs are transparent and accountable, and users comprehend how their information is being used. An alternative step is to create an artificial intelligence ethics board in companies. This panel should feature specialists in disciplines such as law and computer science, as well as members of the communities that are most likely to be influenced by AI tools. This board should be given the power to examine and pass judgment on AI systems before they are made available to the masses. To maximize the potential of AI applications like ChatGPT, developers should design with ethical considerations in mind, invest in an AI ethics board, and provide relevant and transparent feedback mechanisms. This will give users the agency to report any issues they may encounter with the applications and make it easier for companies to address these issues immediately. In conclusion, while AI applications can revolutionize the way we interact with technology, their use could lead to abuse and harassment. To decrease the chances of this happening, developers should ensure they follow ethical design principles, appoint an AI ethics board, and allow users to report any issues they experience.